Welcome back to John's Daily Calls, where I break down what you guys need to buy and sell. Today we have a new leaked SPC where I'm bringing you guys, as I've already posted this in the Discord, but if you guys want to see this, all you have to do is subscribe to twitch.tv slash John Sims, and then you guys gain access to my premium calls where you guys get to see this video before anyone else does. So if you guys like seeing premium content before anybody else does, uh, if you like this content, and you don't want to, them to mess up your trades or anything like that, make sure you guys subscribe. But anyways, go ahead and talk about it. We have 61% market momentum on the top 100. That means everything is going up. You're going to see this almost every Monday. Most Mondays, you're going to see this. So when people come in and say, hey, John, when should I buy my teams? It's always Saturday, Sunday, always Saturday, Sunday. And let me show you guys a quick, uh, let me just show you guys a quick card because I just know this card is uh, very concurrent or with congruent with the market. But basically, guys, Saturday, Sunday, boom, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Saturday, Sunday, boom, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, peak, right? Saturday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, peak, right? So basically, that type of stuff is going to be really easy to trade. If you don't know what to do, you guys can kind of buy that type of stuff and get in on trades all, all week long. But right now, what we really want to talk about are the investments. Um, me personally, guys, we made a call for Van Dyke at 620000 So if you guys followed that in the premium and yesterday, um that was kind of the moves but he never really went down there too far so we saw it right there and that was really where we wanted to get in um and he kept on pushing i actually did not go in on vvd even though i wanted to get in on him instead i uh i diversified into some bruno Fernandes, and i bought at like 135 uh if you guys were with me i was live for 12 hours yesterday guys so uh um, if at any point you guys could have popped into the live. And so right now we're up. We're already up towards that sell point already into that. Now, Berardi, uh, Berardi's staying a little bit flatter, but uh, depends on where really where you bought him at, though. Had you been able to buy him down here, you know, 42, four, like underneath that percentage, then he's starting, he might start to pull up a little bit. This one's a little bit on that one's uh, probably the most risky out of all of them. Uh, so just be careful on that. Now, the timetable on these is a little bit. Uh, the, the timetable is, you know, we're thinking 72 hours here. So if you look at this 16 and, and like a card like this, guys, you're not trading it to 25K. That's not like what we're thinking on this. We're thinking buy it at 16, sell it at like 20, sell it at 19. Try to take those, you know, load it up and take a marginal percentage uh, right before we try hopefully hopefully we don't hit a uh, crash here in the upcoming week but those are kind of the moves right now on the informs uh me personally as you guys know what i'm really in is uh trailblazers this week and we are up 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 i am going to be talking about these rt2ks too as well i picked up six i believe of these guy of 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 robertson's here at like the one well i bought him right here i bought him here uh, before the move so I, I bought him here nothing came down everything was cheapest uh on the saturday which uh last week of course you know past the best predictor of the future but the paradox predictability all that stuff if you guys know what i'm talking about basically uh it switched it flip-flopped it flip-flopped us from last week to this week so uh we see we saw uh Robertson kind of flipped there. Now I am on in on uh, Marquinhos as well. I got him at three, I think, right around three eighty. I got him here, so I bought Robertson around this time, and then later on, I tried to see on this next drop. But I really wanted to get in on this last mo that last move down, right around midnight on the UK. I wanted to get in before anything else happened. So. We did see a small sell-off right there at 412, if you see that, which is a little bit interesting because 412,000 means that it may have been... What? Why well, would it do that? Uh, 412,000 times 0.95, boom. 391, so you're seeing profit uh, from three... You're seeing like seven, ten thousand 10,000 coins from these guys, and you're seeing... Um, like 25k from these guys so it's nothing massive off of this scale uh just but so i i don't think that's gonna i think we're gonna bull right through it uh with holding especially as people sell off their rttks now everybody was talking about james ward prowse yesterday i just didn't even look at this card but it's been moving man it's been moving this one's might want might have been one of the better looks like so far already breaking seven percent and pushing 
So that that's already almost near a 10% return. So some of this stuff is starting to move up. Guys, I'm not really looking to hold on to this past Wednesday. Uh, as you guys know, keep in touch with us, and uh, we'll we'll keep you guys informed. But I've got a couple of all of those. Now, RTTK Team 1, I'm not so set on. Um, you're seeing, you've are seeing you seen a drop from Mbappe. You're starting to see drops from some of these guys. Um, the only one I still kind of like is that Di Lorenzo. I don't know why, but I just feel like if that, that one gets a good card, it's just going to going to be there but uh i'm not really on that team of the week either before we get into fodder let's uh let's go check out team of the uh the oh yes we have a potential new team of the week as well as you guys may know we have salah griezmann goretzka politano um murphy now this politano card may affect uh could help or hurt uh, what's his name? Uh, but Frimpong, a new Frimpong uh, leak as well. So uh, that that's all going to be potential coming out. Though the one thing I really wanted to talk about though was, I guess, did we talk? We talked about this team of the week. Yes, we got up up here. RTTKs. They're so far down now that uh, RTTKs. So okay, so here's the thing, guys. As you guys know, I sold my Modric at the tippy top yesterday, right around here. All right, I sold my t I sold right around here, um, and the reason why is because I went off that profit margin, okay? And so it looks like uh, some people sold back on the back end on the other side, and so it makes sense that guys we called this. This is this was gonna happen the day before the game. The highest point is always there. Now this should rebound. So if you're at 350 and you're like, oh, John, should I sell? I didn't sell. I didn't sell. Um, we sold live on stream, so uh, you guys, all you had to do is just be in the live. But uh, basically, we sold live on stream, and I called, I called the video from, from, uh, from yesterday that we were potentially going to take a take a call right at three seventy seven, three seventy eight. I think we ended up making it, uh, and so I sold it late on lazy through it, so it, it ended up pushing, and uh, basically I sold that now. Am I out on uh, Lewandowski? Not necessarily. He didn't. He didn't move as much, and uh, I think it's because he's not as as invested. And so I was waiting for that 560 move again before I sold this. So I'm still in on one of them. I'm just not in on both of them. I did sell off on here. I do think you'll recoup. I do believe it'll come back up. Will, do I think it'll go right up to 390? Like it'll show now. It'll it may show 375, may 360, 360, or it may be here. Uh, basically, if you see this move up another three, four percent, I'd probably take it off and just just move on from it. So uh, that's that is before the hype. Hype is here, so get in, get out. That's going to be the idea. Fodder guys, what did I on stream? I literally said 84 is going to be the greatest to trade, guys. We are in for. 80, I'm, I can't explain to you guys how happy I am to see 84s right here at 1.5. This, right now, I want, I want. if you guys know what the 84 method is in this Discord server, if you guys know what I'm talking about, you guys see this at content, you need to do this. You need to do this. If you guys have no coins, like this is, that is it. Uh, be liquid for that. Now, 6K on 85s. I'm holding about 75, 80s, 85s. I bought it around 4K. Uh, we're at 6K. We have that fourth SBC that could possibly that could come before the next uh, fodder or fodder uh, fodder drop. So uh, I'm holding on to it, guys, and I think we could we could see the moon. So um, I don't know how far, but that's why you guys tune in every single day. Don't forget to like, uh, subscribe to twitchtv John Sims if you want to see this before anybody else does. And until next time, guys, uh, no live stream today. No live stream today. Uh, we'll be back tomorrow. But until next time, guys, thanks for watching. As always, good day trading. See you tomorrow.